a memorial site will be established in Region 8 to honor the 20 children who lost their lives during the horrific Madia Secondary School dormitory fire in May last year. Prime Minister Brigadier Retired Mark Phillips made the announcement when he attended a memorial ceremony in Maikobi, Region 8, on Tuesday. The Ministers of Labor, Tourism, Industry and Commerce, and Housing and Water accompanied the Prime Minister. Soon, we will also immortalize the memory of our lost girls and boys by establishing a memorial site. A necessary move to ensure that the lives of these 20 young people will always be etched in our minds and in our memory. One of the most important lessons from the Mali tragedy is the imperative to protect our children. In the face of this profound tragedy, our country has shown remarkable strength and resilience. There are times our country may seem divided, but when news of this tragedy became known, our country stood still. And Guyanese from all walks of life showed solidarity with the grieving families. Minister of Natural Resources Vikram Bharat also journeyed to Chenapau for a similar event. To be with you here today and to show solidarity because we are one family, we are one Guyana. And we owe it to these children, we owe it to them that we continue to live in a way to demonstrate unity, to demonstrate cohesiveness. Minister of Local Government and Regional Development, Sonia Parag, and Minister within the Office of the Prime Minister with Responsibility for Public Affairs, Kwame McCoy, were also present. Over in Karisparu, Minister of Amerindian Affairs, Pauline Sukai, and Minister of Housing and Water, Colin Cole, paid tribute to the victims of the tragedy. Let's all join hands now to celebrate their memories to ease the pain to their family and relatives, to remember their laughter and the joy they brought to their families, to the teachers, to the village. For the short time they were with us 